Hello, hello, you like vans? Because I got two, and one of them has free candy. Yes, that's right, today we're taking a look at Earthrise Ratchet and Ironhide. <laughs> Some of the harder figures to acquire over the course of Earthrise, but I managed, and I hope you did too. And if you're wondering about Prowl, I already reviewed him and the other Dats and Brothers Minus Barricade. Link in the description, or maybe in the iCard if I'm not lazy. And if you're wondering about Lifeline, she, Alita1, and RC will be getting a video very soon. I, I, I like to gang molds together, so I didn't really I didn't want to include her. But anyway, now back to Ironhide and Ratchet. First, with the accessories. They both come with a gun, one in black, one in white, same mold, and everything else. And that can peg onto any 5mm port on the figure, so uh, go wild, I guess. Um... Oh, and they also come with the top of the van. Uh, yeah. This is fun. Anyway, same deal. One is red, one is white, with a light bar on top, so, you know, a little more plastic. And you can use that as a shield for Ironhide, or for Ratchet, and a gurney for Ratchet, or Ironhide. Or plug it onto the back. Uh, so yeah, overall, decent accessories. Uh, thanks, Hasbro. Now on to the main figures. Starting off first with Ironhide. He's a red van guy, right? I guess. He's the security chief, right? Uh, he's also the weapons guy. It, it works. Very faithful to G1. So it's good. Bit of an odd color choice, though. Like, there are three different reds. And I, it's kind of hard to tell in person, but man, like, it, it's there. But also, look at that head sculpt. Fantastic. I love the silver face with blue eyes. And that crest on the top, perfection, right? I really dig this one. Next up is the same thing, but white. So, white Ironhide. Whiter Hide. Yeah, that, that. Uh, he's a doctor. Uh, and yeah, he's an absolutely incredible figure. I love all the white and how smooth he feels. What a absolute killer robot. Or, or rather, a, a reviver is maybe a medical thing. But regardless, I love it. He also has a hint of red. Not much, but I think it's fine. Definitely looks better in hand. And that head. Oh, that head. Very good. I love what they did. It looks incredible. Overall, I really like Ratchet. Definitely a lot more than Ironhide. Now on to Articulation. It's just the Siege figure, so not much new. But I did like the Siege mold, so I don't mind this. And I love how tight Ratchet's joints are. No discredit to Ironhide. His joints are also tight. But they're both amazing. Ratchet is just a tiny bit better. And now on to size comparisons. Here they are with some Autobots and Decepticons. It looks fantastic, as it should. And here they are next to the Siege Mold. And the only one I own anymore is Crosshairs. And it looks amazing, so A+. Plus. Woo! And wow. Would you believe me if I told you these things could transform? I could. Regardless, I like transforming Ironhide more. Ratchet is a bit weird with pegs, but overall, I love this transformation. Very fun. It's just the Siege one with an added parts forming, but amazing nonetheless. It totally pulls it off. And would you look at that. They're vans now, I guess. That's what they turn into. Regardless, these are okay. Not the best, but a solid little block of plastic, and they look good enough. I'm not going to go over them individually. One is white, and one is an ambulance, and one is red, and that's it. Like... They're, they're good, like, there's, there's obviously the, the problems with them, like, the feet and stuff, but hey, I like them, and that's all that matters. And hey, guess what? You can also plug the gun on top, or even in the shield, a vehicle mode. Neat. So that's a cool little fun thing. And that has been my review of Earth Ice, Ironhide, and Ratchet. A fun mold that has a decent vehicle mode, and a fun robot mode. If you can even get these guys anymore, I really re highly recommend it. I will leave links in the description to the pages to buy them. They are Amazon exclusives. And by the way, I do leave the links for all the toys I review in the description of that video. So you can go buy them if they're available. Just a little tidbit. Thanks for watching. See ya, see ya!